the magic of YouTube, you're going to see Luxury Diva unboxing, and I'm not even here. I'm out of town at my other son's house, but you're going to see it anyway. It's magic. Oh, I didn't, un didn't cut it well enough. doesn't want to open. This is the December Luxury Diva. Come on. Ooh, what is this? Well, here's the, they always give you a list. It says value 108. There's five things. Luxury Diva. Accessories box is a monthly delivery of fun, fashion, and style for women. Packed with a surprising, with a surprise variety of five to six products, which can include anything from apparel, scarves, gloves, hats, socks, hosiery, handbags, wallets, sunglasses, jewelry, cosmetics, and home goods. All yours to keep. So, this is a super soft purple blankie. Value $23. The dogs keep chewing up my blanket, so now I have another one. <laughs> it's nice. Feels good. Oh, we got a card. We haven't got one in a while. From Marina, the one that owns the place, and she used to send a card all the time, but she got too busy, I guess. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. All right. I like it. And I won't, hopefully the doggies won't chew it up. Oh, we got a candy cane. She always sends some kind of treat. It's, I prefer red and white old fashioned peppermint candy canes, but this, this will be good too. <laughs> but, uh, I'm just old fashioned, I guess. I like the peppermint ones. Okay, what do we have here? I don't know. Let's see if I can figure it out. Italia Deluxe Four Pack Ultra Fine Long Eyeliner Pencils. $18. Are they different colors or why did you get four? Let's see. This one's brown. This one's black. See, they've got the color on the base. Brown, black. Come on, get out of you. Looks like gray. And like a cobalt blue. Ooh, that's a pretty color. We're going to do, several of us are doing in January, we're doing a winter wonderland type eye look in blues and silvers whites stuff like that so this eyeliner might come in handy and here's some oh i don't have pierced ears but my granddaughter might like these they're pretty they got like little blue beads and then gold hoops she mostly wears silver but i'll see if she wants them if not I'll put them in a giveaway for you guys. I've got my little stash of giveaway stuff that I keep to give you. Let's see. Blue teardrop beaded earrings, $26. Oh, aren't these cute? Once in a while, I'll wear gloves. They got reindeer on them. They're so cute. It's supposed to be, it's crazy. It's, today it's supposed to be 81. Tomorrow it's supposed to be 85. And then the next day, it's going to drop below freezing in, at night. It's going to be like 50, high of 50 and low of like 29 or something. So you're going from 85 to 29 in 24 hours. Crazy Texas weather. These are adorable. It says... They're thermal, so something in them keeps you warm, extra warm. But there's, these are so cute with the little deers on them. I love them. Hopefully they fit my, 
I've got small hands, so they should fit. I'm not too worried about it. I'm not going to take them apart right now. But, yeah. Those are cute. And then, ooh, there's something fuzzy in here. What is this? I don't know what it is. <laughs> um, got a button on it. Don't know. Is it an infinity scarf? I, uh, I gotta read what this is because I can't tell. Oh, it is an infinity scarf, but it's just a short one. Let's see. This I definitely would never wear. It's I don't like it up tight around my neck and it's really, really warm. It's really nice and soft and warm. It's for one of my northern girl friends. Somebody want it? <laughs> Let me know if you want it. Maybe I'll send it to you for Christmas. But I never know I won't wear it. But it's soft. It's black and fuzzy. And its value is... $26. So we've got the Infinity Scarf. Mm, nice and soft. These adorable reindeer gloves, which I will keep even though I don't wear gloves very often. I want them. I'm going to keep them. Um, all these different colors of eyeliner. I don't know if they're... I'm going to keep them so I'm going to try them. I don't know if they're like a pencil eyeliner or more of a liquid? Oh, it's a pencil. There's the brown one. I want to see what that blue one looks like. Where's the blue one? That's this one. I don't use pencil ones very often, but that blue one Definitely will come in handy for my the winter wonderland look. They roll, look. I don't like pencil ones usually because they're hard to get on, but these go on really smooth, so I might use these. And, you know, you've got four different colors here. So that's kind of nice. Use the gray for a smoky look or whatever. And what else do we get? Oh, the earrings. Those are pretty. I don't have pierced ears, so I can't wear those. So that's maybe I'll give them to my granddaughter. Okay, what is this? Did I miss this? Where'd this come from? Got these out of some other box and laid them aside, I guess, because I found some brushes, but I don't think they're part of this. I'm just like, where'd these come from? I don't know. <laughs> but it must be some other box I got them in because they're not on this list of things. But the other thing was this purple blankie. That I get cold out in the living room and the stupid dogs chewed up my favorite one. A little bit so then I put it in the bed for the big white dog Bella the one that keeps running off but I got her I mean it's a pain to do but I've got got her figured out if I get up at six o'clock before it turns light and let her in she won't run off so I've been getting up at six o'clock every morning to let her in so she doesn't run off so I had a doctor's appointment oh that's what I talk to you guys about I went and got my mammogram and a bone density scan. And if you have not done that, well, the bone density one, you only need to do like every five years or something. But if you haven't had a mammogram in a, in a year, get your booty out there and get a mammogram. It's just not that bad. Just suck it up and do it. it you need to do it every year. So get your appointment going for next year if you haven't had one in over a year. But anyway, I had to be there at 7.15 and it was a half an hour away because I live out in the country. Everything's a half an hour away or more. And so I got up to, at 6 to let her in 
and she was nowhere to be found. And I'm like, oh no, she ran away already. What am I gonna do? Because I don't have time to go get her. I gotta leave it in 15 minutes or whatever. And right before I left, I went out and called her again and she came back. Back. She was just out in the yard. We've got five acres, so she was somewhere in the five acres and just didn't hear me or didn't want to come or whatever, but she came and I'm like, oh, thank God, because I didn't have time to go pick her up somewhere if she wandered off somewhere. And my grandson was, you know, I had already left for school and everybody else out of town. I'm like, oh, great, lost dog. But luckily she came home and just in time or came to the door just in time. I'm sure she was already already in the yard somewhere, but you know, five acres is big. She's, she's off somewhere. So anyway, that's your, for today, go get your mammogram if you haven't done it already. So I will, I'm at my son's house tomorrow. This is, I'm going to upload this Friday. So tomorrow with my youngest granddaughter, who's 17 for her birthday, which was in October, but I haven't seen her since then. She's taken an SAT or ACT or one of them kind of tests Saturday morning, but then after she gets back and rests for a while, we're going to go shopping together. I'm going to buy her whatever she wants, well, within reason, whatever she wants, and take her to lunch for her birthday, which belatedly two months. But hey, and I don't think the two of us have ever been alone together, ever, in her whole life, unless she, when she was a baby baby, maybe, but not in a really, really long time. So it would be nice just to be just the two of us. And then, then I'm coming back Sunday afternoon sometime after church. So I'm leaving tomorrow morning. They live about a little over 100 miles away, so a couple hours. So I'm leaving tomorrow morning and then coming back Sunday afternoon or evening. So I'm going to post this on Friday. And then next time you hear from me will be mask monday oh i've been wa rambling forever this is going to be the longest video no my i just did a nadine west one yesterday that's going to be the world's longest video they sent me 12 things and had to talk about beforehand try them on talk about them after you know took forever so that's a super long video thanks for your patience y'all Get out there and get your shopping done and get that mammogram. Bye-bye.